So don't waive that home inspection. It's not worth it. You can raise the contingency from $1,500 to $2,000 if you want, make it a little more appealing, but that's only if you can afford it. And when I say waive or raise the contingency, what am I talking about? I'm talking about that one item, structural, or if you have a safety or health um, issue with the house, although that really doesn't apply to the $1,500, but it's not a collection, it's one item of structural damage to your home. So maybe the foundation or the roof or the furnace doesn't work and to replace it costs $1,500 or more. You can raise that to $2,000. Give it some thought, but stick to the home inspections because that's protecting you and your investment. Come on, it's not every day you buy a $200,000 home, a $300,000 home, $400,000 home, $500,000 home. You get it. It's not every day you're throwing that money away. And if you're buying a new home and you've got a new budget, do you really want to put out $2,000 or $3,000 for a new furnace, new hot water tank, when it was called out at inspections? And it was called out as a major $1,500 or more. No, you don't. You want to move in your house and enjoy it. Remember that. Don't waive home inspections and don't raise the contingency if you don't have to.